destroy those televisions. Patrick, you've collected enough Goofy Goober tokens. All right, so I can basically throw anything. So, as such, we will. There is an improved one where he does a little spinny rule, but let's just blow these up. I need the uh, I need the monster points here, or the macho points, Ma macho man, macho. I don't know. Man, you know the macho man savage points. It's not good. This is like the second version of the steamed game. Patrick gets steamed, but like in a really disgusting tar pit. I don't know what they titled it, but uh, it's basically like that. I don't know. It's pretty simple. forever. They do sink after a little bit. Oh, I made that. Thank God. Okay, can't screw this up, I don't think. Let's see here, let's, there we go, now I just have to navigate these. Okay, that thing just shut off so I've got time. And we jumped these platforms and we did it. Oh gosh. I'm surprised both missed. Oh, I hit the TV. Let's go. Didn't even intend for that to happen. Pretty happy it happened, but I didn't intend for it to happen. I want these goobers gone. They keep getting in my face, and it's so annoying. I, I can't. Uh, they keep getting in my face that I can't turn around to. There, I got them. this all right watermelon to robot head oh great okay so let's get rid of you I don't really give a crap about the others they can say
We finally get them. All right. Let's just clue back in here and destroy these. Factory, our point is just going to say a bunch of derogatory things. And we destroy the TV for that. And goodbye. Three Meter Island is another mini game for Patrick. It's actually very simple, but also can be very complicated if you don't have the upgraded spin. All you basically have to do is climb a bunch of stuff and get out of some sticky situations with enemies, but they are pretty easy as long as you get, again, the upgraded. This is a vat of slime slash acid. I have actually no idea. Plankton really went all out to prevent stuff, didn't he? Another button. Okay, so... He... Won't do anything until you get here. Just avoid his stuff. There we go, he did, and now we move on. Now we have to face two of them. One down. There we go, I activated him. Sounds like there's another one somewhere, but there isn't. I think the audio might be a little bugged, but whatever. I think there's only one more level to this as well, so... Now it's the three-headed disgusting vomitrons that are... How is this guy still alive? Weirdo. Now we basically just stay afloat on these buoys, climb the stairs, and capture the easiest. And I believe this is the end of the level. Okay, so we have to decapacitate. I don't even know if that's the right word. We have to have an object to throw at that. Just so we can get a platform. I definitely spun. Alright. Let's take this out. Or not. All right. Oh, I did not want that. It was a mistake. I don't even think I get another chance at anything else. Nope. Okay. Alright, there we go. That one's done. And now we kill you. I don't 
I think this button's already... No, it has not. I have to do this all again, because I have to have all these buttons pushed. Dude, I can't do anything with this thing in my face. I have like a thousand different obstacles to do. Damn, dude. I'll be projectile bonnets over here so I can destroy him. There. He's done. How are these two just here? There. Goodbye. Goodness me. Let's end this. Can I throw from here? Nope, I'm short. I might be able to do it on two, but... Alright. Well, the first go didn't go about well, so we have to do it again. There we go. Nailed it.